But, uh, explain the process of charging an electroscope. Okay? When I, when I brought this close, brought it away. Did it charge it? No. No, because it's, it's showing no charge. It's a charge detector, there is no charge. So, if I want to charge an electroscope, So, everybody needs to be quiet, okay? So, what we're going to listen for, obviously if I, you know, run right up to it and touch it, you know it's been touched, but also we can listen. So, heard it? I heard it. No, do it again. I win. Okay, quiet. <laughs> I heard it. I heard it. Whoa! Whoa! It's really quiet. You touched What's the it. charge detector showing? Whoa. There is charge. Man. There is charge. Now, is there charge because this is close to the top? No. No. It's a new reason. So. Same first drawing. Yeah. Sure. I'm never going to check it, so it's, no, no, so whatever you need. Now. Wait, which box is this? The one next to it? This is explain the process of charging an electroscope. Wow. Right here, now we write touching. What's our freebie? Protons. 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 Now, I'm not going to, on a quiz, I'm not going to be like, oh, you, you missed one electron, and I, I'm not going to count 30 electrons on everybody's page. But, what, I wouldn't, so don't completely freak yourself out about it. But if all I look at your drawing and you're missing three, four, five protons, there will be points taken off. If you're missing or magically gained a bunch of electrons, there will be points. Okay? So let you guys know what to expect. Now, on this, I have all these electrons. And they're all cooped up and you know it's like, oh, this is an electron party, I hate this. Yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> electrons in this case, really, electrons have two things on their mind. They want to get away from other electrons, and they want to get with some protons. Okay? Right? So, right now, they're all cooped up, and they're like, this sucks. <laughs> now, so what they want to do, they want to spread out. Over here, they're like, hey, you know, this is pretty good. It's one to one. So what they're going to do guys are all grouped together, they're going to say, hey, let's spread out a little bit. So they are going to transfer over. Now, I know right now that it'd be happy. But that means that the electroscope is really unhappy. Oh. So are all, is it actually going to go to neutral? No, because if it went to neutral, then the ones on the electroscope would say, hey, we're out of here, and they'd run back. So what might happen, some of them will run over. So let's see, I have three, four, five, six, seven. I'm going to leave four behind, which means three ran onto here. So now one, two, three, four. I'm going to make it one to one, which was what it was before. And now there's an extra three. So I have one, two, three. I bring the rod away. Here's my electroscope. About the rod afterwards. Mm -hmm. It is negative. 
There are more negatives than positives. Oh, one, two, three, I four. I see that one. And the entire electroscope no, now, it is net negative, including down here, it's local negative as well. Therefore, negative, negative, it's going to repel. That arm is going to move as far away from pot it can as possible. And that actually has a negative charge. 